Hell no, you're Chucky. using red conductor. Oh, it's thing. placeholder. What's placeholder? The red dirt. No, that's just. Why, why, why are you removing like it? Construction in progress. Okay. It's something we work towards, I guess. Like we're working towards the building. We, we, we need more metal mesh then. Yeah. More metal mesh. Come with me. We can have yeah, fun. Crash course. We can have some fun. All right, I got some more uh, metal mesh. Good. All right. We've actually managed to build ourselves a pretty awesome base. Considering it's all done legit. And we got the biggest quarry on the planet. Do we? I haven't even seen our quarry yet. The only quarry on the planet. Oh yeah, true. <laughs> Alright, what's up everybody? This is Saber and I'm here with Tamino-sama and he is going to be teaching me the ropes of the new crafting system. So we are going to be going on a little mission to get some more... What was it? Ram... Ramite? Mm-hmm. Ramite? Okay, yeah, Purple Ramite. Stuff. Cool. Purple stuff. We need purple stuff. Oh, and so and we're going to go get that, and then he's going to teach me yeah. teach me all kinds of new stuff that I don't understand yet. So, uh, yeah, it's going to be a wonderful, delightful trip. And I just wanted to, you know, do this uh, video so that you guys and I and everybody can all learn at the same time from the wonderful tutelage of Tomino-sama. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is we found, and we don't know if this is the same everywhere, but different plates have different stuff when you go on a planet. So you might not necessarily have to go to a different planet. But anyway, come, come, come this way. You see on yonder hill, there <laughs> yes, is there the is a beacon of light. Beacon? Yeah. We're going to run to that beacon. So All right, let's, let's do, do this. I thoroughly also recommend Also along for the ride is Yelby. That's and, not new. Uh, See this? This is the first beacon. All right, beacon. Now there's another beacon over there. First thing is going to be really awesome. There's a GUI for all this, and you can do a limited amount of it in your personal area. Okay. Yep. So basically, I'm going to untab G myself and hit mm, same. hit I. And you'll notice there's a whole bunch of new buttons on your inventory now. Yep. You got craft capsule, craft micro, and craft factory. Um, if you just go onto craft capsule for starters and click on production info, it should show you. Basically, it'll turn any shard or ore into capsules of the correct name. Yeah. So like one shard gets you ten capsules. One ore gets you 10 capsules, yeah? Okay, yeah, so basically it's just a list of what you could make from these different things. Well, yeah, but the important thing is that you could be running around and you're actually smelting on your suit, you know, effectively. Oh, nice. You're kind yeah. of. So it's the first tier anyway, right? Now, yeah. so you just basically chuck a bunch of crystals into that slot there and it'll start oh, yeah. making them into capsules, right? Yeah, I had actually, I had actually done that with some, mm. um, excuse me, with some high tall, and, um, and then I clicked the production info, and then by the time I got out of it, I already have the uh, capsules. Yeah, and then while that's happening, so you could have hundreds or something, you can have a full stack in there, that'll do that. While that's happening, you can also have the craft micro there, okay? Now, yep. for craft micro, for some reason, my chain is showing the wrong one. But what it should be showing you is all of the crystals turn into something called a crystal circuit. Yep, crystal circuit. Yep. And then all of and then the metal ores mesh. turn into metal mesh. Yeah. Yeah. All the metals turn into metal mesh. So, and it will also show. So, and then craft factory, right? Will show you. And again, it's bugged on my screen, but I showed it earlier. Um, craft factory shows you that you need i think it's 20 metal mesh or 20 circuit boards to make the macro assembler which is basically yep. the third tier assembly uh factory you know um mm -hmm. you you can once you've built that you can craft something called a capsule assembler capsule refinery 
which basically makes your capsules faster than you would on your person yeah okay and you can also make a micro assembler which again does it quicker than your just doing it in your inventory um there's also enhancers you know so that you can further you know charge more power for each tick and make it go make it do more units i think um so that gives you three blocks right and we'll do some mining first and then we'll uh we'll go back to the uh go back to the factory and i'll show you how to do it i've got thrusters right okay so basically i mate, do not have thrusters follow me yep i'm gonna go up here that was the first house down there. This to the factory. The All right. Factory. Come up over here. And your lack of a staircase. <laughs> we've got super jump. We don't need a staircase. That's true. All right, cool. So what we're going to do then, first of all, the first thing that you make is the one on the far right. Okay. There is a, right. there is a block of four of them, but I'll get to that. Okay. Okay. Basically, first this first one on the left. If you push R on it, you'll see it yep. says metal mesh. Yep. And I won't click on that yet. We'll click on the one next to it, which says graph, metal mesh. Got it. Every single thing that you set on one of these has got a graph, and it shows you what you need and what it will make. At the moment, nice. it's making metal mesh wedges out of metal mesh. Yeah? Can yeah. I get those thrusters, guys? And the power blocks? Um, yeah, yeah, sure. Hang on a sec. Sorry to interrupt, but... Uh... No, that's fine. We I? must space. That's the power of editing. All right, hang on. I, I, I think you will appreciate, of all people, building a spaceship. Oh, uh, absolutely. Where are my thrusters? More spaceship. Where are my thrusters? All right, there's power. And that's all the power. Oh, I do have go. three cans with no computer. There you go. There's my drop. And salvaged. I've, wait, what else did you want? I've got I've given you my thrusters. I need power and thrusters. I ain't got any power. And salvage. Yeah, oh, salvage. Like, oh, salvage. Yeah, okay. I've got ten salvage cannons right there. Oh, 32 here. Nice, that's, there we go. That's all the ones we were making. I think we can get into space with this. I think we can get into space with a spaceship. Yup. I still only have seven power. Did Tom pick any up, or is that all we got? Seven uh, power. Uh, I think, no, I only dropped seven. That's all I had left. Um, someone must have already picked them up out of the factory, because I haven't got them. Yeah, that's all I had. Well, that's where I had. I got the. Apparently, ones I, I got had, seven so. power blocks in my inventory all, all right, of a sudden. So there we go. Awesome. Nice. I'll come over there. Right then. So where were we, Saber? The macro <laughs> assembler. Yeah. So the macro yeah. is the top level, and you can make anything in the game with this. So we were looking okay. at the graph, and that shows you what you need to put in it. So if we put metal yep. mesh in this, it'll make a metal it'll mesh make wedge. wedges. But yep. say we Speaking wanted to which... make. Yeah. What? I need metal mesh. <laughs> yeah, I haven't got any. We, we can't build hull. Well, I've been making it some. We can't build hull yet, so no, metal got mesh. You've got 25 oh, in okay. the top. you got 25 in the top thing there. Anyway, look, we, let, let's just get through this demo. <laughs> right, okay, yeah. so here we go. Basically, metal mesh, right? Say I want a ship core. You click, I'm going yeah. to change it now to ship core, and then okay. I'll let you do it, right? So I've changed it to ship core. So if you go into it now, you should see it says Oh, okay, shipboard. nice. And if you click yeah. on the graph, it shows you you need metal mesh made into metal grill makes ship core. And we'll, we'll, okay, we'll, this is really it, easy then, because like, you literally just do a drop down of anything that you want to make. Yeah, and it's got a filter. So if you say huh. you want change it to change it to something that you want now, just click on it and click on the filter and type something and then click the drop down. Yeah. And just search for like I don't know. Okay, yeah, I did I did blacks just to look up black hole and so and that it yeah. Filters it for you. So it's really quick, Very and nice. really easy. Right, nice. So now we've black seen this, you can see from the poison. <laughs> you can like poison. Yeah, there's some crazy stuff in there, but don't worry about that. Huh. <laughs> okay, what we're going to do now is take a quick look at the blocks that come before this, because obviously you can have enhancers to increase this efficiency. You know, just like the old system. Um, but anyway, coming back to here, yeah, this is the micro assembler, which can be made with the macro assembler. So the first thing that you make pretty much is the capsule refinery and the micro assembler. Okay. They have to be made using the macro, 
right? Um, okay, and you make the macro with uh, well, crafting from your inventory? The macro is made from crafting in your inventory, yeah. It's 20, okay, yeah. it's like 20 circuit boards or 20 meshes will make you the okay. macro. Uh, the, gotcha. These ones only require 10. <laughs> The refinery. Yeah, I just wanted to kind yeah. of get that hierarchy set up of what you need to make first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, like I say, if you quickly just come back over to the macro, yeah? Yeah. And um, I'll change it. I'll just type in micro and then use the drop down, micro assembler. If you check it out now. Yep. You'll be it able actually to updates if I'm in it too. So. Oh, nice. You'll be able to see yeah. that you only need metal mesh, 10 metal mesh to oh, make okay. a micro nice. assembler. If I change cool. it again then to uh, the capsule, so C A P cap capsule refinery. There we go, and then you can see ten metal mesh. It also takes metal, yeah. Right. Cool. So um, if we go over to the capsule refinery, then use the one on the left yep. because it's got loads of stuff in it. Right. Okay. Yeah. I, I've been using this as a cheap plex storage. I know you shouldn't, but basically, <laughs> you know, it's not going to get turned into anything, and we needed somewhere to share stuff. So if you, yeah, you've chucked that Ramit shard in there, yeah? I'll, I'll throw yep. a few in as well. Basically, it'll start turning that Ramit shard into Ramit capsules. So that's what the capsule refinery does. The only reason that we've got two here like this is I've got the top one doing crystals and the bottom one doing metals. Yes, you can be cooking more stuff so yep. you've basically got basically like a forge thing. yeah because then then you've got the crystals coming out like the, you've got the circuit boards coming out here and you've got the wet uh, yeah the the mesh coming out here cool right um yeah sorry the caps capsules hey sorry. general you got another uh <laughs> got another core on you no i don't Do you know I if you grab another core bit. you can hop in the salvage computer and launch with me I actually skipped a bit slash messed that up. I merged these by accident. Basically, the refinery, you put all of the crystal shards in the top one, and it makes you crystal capsules. Are we ready for launch? You put all we, we oh, need okay. that spare core. You put all of the ore, um, all of the... All right, let's bore the launch for now, then. You put all the ores in the bottom one, and it makes you the ore capsules. And then we do the same okay. thing here. So this is now yeah. the micro-assembler. The micro assembler turns your circuit boards into and your capsules into circuit sorry, boards. Sorry, capsules into circuit boards and capsules okay. yeah, into I see. meshes. Right. So then finally we can full circle back to the macro assembler. And you can see we've already got this set up. So the bottom yeah. two, if you look at the bottom left one, that's making metal. Yeah, we well, got cores. Okay. Out of the metal mesh. Because a lot awesome. of, a lot of the recipes need a metal mesh. So you basically take six metal grills and turn them into a metal mesh, and then you can use that in a further tier recipe. And then the one, nice. on, the, one on the right is basically making uh, charged crystal circuits. So all the crystal circuits, you know, a lot of them need to be converted into these charged crystal circuits to make yeah. your end item. So charged crystal circuit, right? I know you guys are busy doing factory, but would you like to see us off on a rocket launch? Oh yeah, launch? that's I've pretty much. Yeah, that's the end. That's the end. Yeah, of, that's that's yeah, everything. I was just gonna do a quick review, and then uh, then I'll yeah, then we can watch that. Okay, so basically, I just want to do this from my understanding, just so you can catch if I get anything wrong. Yeah. Uh, first thing you guys are gonna make is gonna be the macro assembler, uh, which you can then use to create the uh, capsule, uh, capsule refinery. refinery. Yeah. And then that makes a micro assembler, which then goes back into making components for making other stuff in the macro assembler. So basically, yeah, that's going to be a first item, and then the capsule, and then, yeah, micro, and back to macro. Yeah. So thank you very much, Tom. That was a huge help, because I had no idea. Like, when I logged on, whatever, half an hour, an hour ago, I just had no idea what any of this new stuff was.